Let's get through the six. I'm going to look at the box score here. And I talk about Paul George a little bit. Uh, as they lose to the Phoenix Suns, 1-18-1-16. One, one, They're now 1-5. and five. The Suns are 6-1. and one. Um, So last night, uh, I'm in a city, and I'm walking down a street. And I'm walking down a, a row home laden street. And it was like ground level. It was not a stoop, though. It was ground level with the sidewalk. And so, you, you know, I, I glance in the window of somebody's living room. And the TV is uh, sh- is on, and uh, the Reba show is on. That's going back, right? That's not I, I, now. I, I don't know. I found that very odd. Is that odd, or is or am I odd? Like it was like, you know, it was like nine thirty maybe. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> Wait, what channel is that going to be? It's going to be like what country that, music. What is right? that show called? The Reba McIntyre show. Isn't it just called Reba? It's called Reba, right? Yeah, so it went off the air in 07. <laughs> it was a sitcom, went off the air in yeah, 07. I, I don't know. I oh, wait, she's got a new show. Oh, I don't think this was the new show. The new show's called Happy's Place. Really? I don't know, maybe so it's maybe it's the new show, Mike. Possible. All right. Well, that then. would make more sense. Yeah, because yeah, if I someone's just watching <laughs> Reba from 17 years I, ago. I just thought it was odd. I, got, I kind of chuckled. Like of all the stuff, all the stuff you could be watching, including that was a big night in Philadelphia, which you know, like the concert was televised and such. And, and Reba was on. <laughs> it's gotta I be. It's, I can't imagine. I find it odd. I maybe I'm odd. Uh, all right, let's look at the box score last night. So Paul George plays for the Sixers. He, he played 32 minutes, which is a lot of minutes for his first night out. Four for 14, one for seven from three. Uh, he had six turnovers. And then, at the end of the game, you're down by one. Of course, it's either he or Maxie is going to get the shot. So, they, I guess, the, the drawing up, it was PG getting the shot. Uh, and he missed a, a two-pointer. And uh, he says afterwards that it was a boneheaded play. Bad evaluation, he says. I thought we were down one. When Durant made the layup to put them up one. Otherwise go for the three to try to win the game as opposed to going for a two to tie a game. So after watching it, another bonehead play, again, in that situation, why not go for the well, like, I, I I don't know how that's possible. I really don't. I mean, come on. You mean to tell me you don't know what the score is? When you take the, they designed the play, you don't have, like, enough wherewithal to know what the freaking score was? Uh, what? It, it, it is egregious. But it would have been more egregious if they were down three and he settled for a two. See, he, he, well, I'm still okay with him taking a two-point shot to yeah, tie I'm it. I'm not th- that displeased either to shoot the two to tie it. Now, you know him really don't want to go into overtime on the road, but and that's why he's probably saying I need a three to win it. But not yeah. to, to admit you didn't know the score is like, it's egregious. It is. I'm surprised he admitted it. Like, why not just lie? Why are, you, why are you revealing that information? Nobody would have thought that you didn't know the score. Yeah. All right. Well, anyway, um, let's look at the, the numbers. But it was a rusty night for PJ. Um, he was plus three, though. Uh, Maxie, 12 for 22, 6 for 14. Boy, he's shooting a lot of three-pointers. And you know what? He, he's not that successful because those, those three-pointers, without everybody on the floor to give it balance, he's rushing a lot of those. They had 32 last night. It was a minus nine. Uh, they only played eight players last night in the early season. The rotation was only eight. Yabuselli had 19 off the bench. Pretty good night for him with seven rebounds. And he was five for 11 from three-point uh, range. Lowry played 28 more minutes. He was okay. And Eric Gordon played 18. And McKean got a, a token three minutes. Yeah, him and, and, KJ, and KJ only Martin, played a couple. Yeah, so that, yeah. Uh, so basically, that was an eight-man rotation. Um, Kelly Oubre, eleven points, uh, minus seven. They were twenty and fifty-one from three. Your boy, Caleb Martin, thirty-nine minutes plus seven, five points, plus seven. Let's just focus on that. Okay, <laughs> you know this is their worst start. The Sixers, yeah, in eight years. What was happening eight years ago? The process. Oh, no. How many process players can you name? Not many. 
Really? I blocked it out in my mind. Let me see. Uh, Tony Roten. Uh, Sims, the center. Henry, yep. Henry Sims. Um, was McConnell uh, a part of the Ho- process? Hollis Thompson. That's right. Big was three a point monster th- process man. Yeah. 31, right? I think he wore number 31. Did he? Yeah, uh, so. Was Rocco he, part of the process? Rocco, yes, I yeah. think he was. Uh, it's tough, though, for the guys that actually got to like play to see a postseason game. Yeah. Let me see if I can get uh, get some more in here. Um, Ish? Ish Smith? Was he a processor? Absolutely. Ish Smith. Was guy <laughs> played, what, 14 was different teams around the league? Was he a processor? Uh, Rashawn Holmes? Was he a Sean. process guy? Yeah. Stay 22. How about Furkan Aldemir? Was Ooh, he a process yes, the, man? The OG Furkan. <laughs> yep. YouTube chat's checking in, too. With <laughs> really? Isaiah Cannon? Cannonball. Oh, Cannonball! Yep. 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 Jarvis Varnado. Jeremy Grant. Uh, Jarvis Varnado. Oh, my God. Jeremy Grant. Jeremy Grant. Yeah. yeah. K.J. McDaniels. How about the kid from Virginia? That stiff from Virginia that's hung around for a really long time. Bulky guy who was supposed to be a really good defender. Remember him? What the hell is his name? I don't know. He got the he to Virginia. Uh, Oh, man. He was here for a long time. Everybody loved him. Oh, man. He couldn't shoot a lick. Uh, oh, how about this one? This is this is a bust out. Jakar Sampson. Ooh, Jakar Sampson, a good one. I'm That's thinking Justin chat. Anderson. That's who it is. It's yeah. Justin Anderson. Justin Anderson. Yeah, yeah, Anderson. The one everyone wanted to bring back because he was boys with the bead. Yes. <laughs> exactly. Hey, but, just use the 15th roster spot to keep a bead happy. How about the kid from Russia that they got? Point guard that started for their Olympic. Oh, Alexi Alexi Sh- Sh- Yeah. It's Shred! <laughs> <laughs> but hold on, Let, let's put this into perspective. Though. What? Even though you don't have Embiid and George, this team has the worst start since the process Sixers? That, that's a little alarming, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Especially when you signed you, role players that you thought were good role players. Yeah, I mean, like, I've defended it saying, look, they're role players, yeah. and you're asking them to play something more than just their role, but... Mm-hmm. Since the process? So what year exactly is the worst start? 2016 was the last time they had a start this bad. To the right, season. I'll give you another one. Got a kid from Spain, point guard. From Spain. It Literally from Spain. from Spain. Oh, man. You remember him? Yeah. Uh, oh, oh, my God. He ended up going back to Europe. He had a career after that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he was God. old when he got here. He was like 30 when he got here. Oh, this he had, is he had a beard. A, such a miss from me right now. I could see the guy in my head. Sergio Oh, Sergio Rodriguez. Rodriguez. What a casual moment by me right here. Not being able to ID Sergio Rodriguez. Sergio Rodriguez. It's going to keep right. me up at night tonight. You had a long night last night. It's all right. So, wait. I just want to go. That, that team that in 2016-17 got off to an 0-7 start mm-hmm. just for fun. That first win against the Pacers in overtime. Paul George was on the other side of that game. Wow. As well as Jeff Teague. What year was that? Uh, 2016-17. So the Sixers won that game. They started one and seven that year. On that uh, Pacers team as well, the boy Allen. Shout out him. Whoa, the boy Allen, who they traded to Indiana. Who did they get for the boy Allen, by the way? Uh, was that when they bought out? It was thirty three. Uh, Danny uh, was it Granger? Danny oh Granger? yeah, Danny yeah. Granger. Yeah, they bought him yeah, out like that's immediately. Right. That's right. Uh, Niang was also on that Pacers team. Did not play in that game. Uh, going down the starting lineup for the Sixers that won that first game to start one and seven. Sergio Rodriguez. Oh, my. Gerald Henderson, Robert Covington, Dario Saric, and Joel Embiid. I'm sorry, Saric had gotten there. Tiago Splitter was also on that team. How about this? Nick Stauskas. Was Stauskas. On that team. Yeah. Oh, God. Jaleel Okafor <laughs> saw time in that game. How about Timete Luawu Cabarro? People were freaking out, needing to find well, that was, man. Was minutes. on that. Air, uh, 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 let's see. Uh, Gerald Henderson. Yeah. Did you say Nerlens already? How about this? How about this bust out name, Jared Bayless? <laughs> who, who, when he got the ball, he got the Tobias treatment. He could not make a shot, and when he got it, people groaned that he was going to shoot it. Jeez. Jared Bayless. Oh my God! What a squad. Sean Long, yeah. Jason Randall. Wow, I feel like I'm transported into a whole other world. Nerlens was on that team, though. Yeah, Nerlens Noel was there. You had Okafor. Alex Poitras from Kentucky. Oof. So, what, what do we think of, I don't know if either one of you got to watch the game. I know Ray had a long night. What do you think of Kate Scott's new call for Yabuselli? Uh, Yabu? 
She goes, yabba dabba do. That's all right. Kind of like it for the I dancing bear. The moment. Yeah, I was, yeah, I, I kind of like it. Good job by Kate. You never have a nickname unless you establish yourself as a player. It used to bother me when she, when she would uh, would give nicknames. Yeah, like undeserve it. Why you quit? Like the uh, like she loved this uh, bang bang George and the Yang. Yeah, bang, 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 bang. Come on, man. All right, I and I love Kate, but I imagine you were not a big uh, the mini bear. The mini bear. <laughs> Come on, man. Yang screams the type of guy that I don't think you would. Oh, uh, he was the anti Miss Anelli back player. Really? <laughs> Starting five for the anti Miss Anelli team. He couldn't have been less of a my liking player. Six one zero six three two zero nine seven five. Back after this.